The presentation will focus on the topic of SNU Avatar, Haptic Glove, Novel Modularized Haptic Glove, via Trigonometric Series Elastic Actuators. The main objective of this project was to design a haptic glove that enhances maneuverability through force feedback. Coupled with the middle phalanx, it allows precise control during teleoperation tasks. Key features include estimating hand posture and delivering force feedback via trigonometric series elastic actuators for smooth interaction with remote environments. The glove ensures stable wear and allows for additional add-ons at the fingertip, enhancing versatility. The haptic module is specifically positioned by considering the direction and location of the MCP joint. By aligning the haptic module with the MCP joint, we ensure that it is more closely integrated with the natural movement of the robot hand, ultimately enhancing the user's control and interaction with the remote environment. Next, the structure of the haptic glove and its key connectivity features will be explained. The haptic glove is equipped with a total of four haptic modules. Additionally, the glove plays a crucial role in external connectivity, which includes integrating with both the user's hand and the haptic arm. This allows for smooth interaction between the glove and the robotic system. Lastly, the glove includes an Arduino unit, which is essential for data acquisition and serial communication, ensuring real-time data transfer and control during operations. Each haptic module is designed with a total of four joints. Among these, one joint is specifically dedicated to the AA movement, or abduction-adduction movement, which is essential for controlling the lateral motion of the finger. The remaining three joints are responsible for the FE movement, flexion and extension, allowing the finger to bend and straighten smoothly during operation. The module is equipped with three potentiometers, which are essential for accurately detecting and measuring the angles of finger joints, ensuring precise movement control. Additionally, one servo motor is installed, providing the necessary actuation to drive the finger movement in coordination with the sensors. Next, the working mechanism of the trigonometric series elastic actuator will be explained. The trigonometric SEA is composed of elastic material and a triangle structure formed by joint 2. As joint 2 moves, the servo motor's angle Q must also adjust accordingly to maintain coordination. When force feedback is required, the motor moves in the opposite direction to compensate and provide the necessary feedback to the user. This interaction between the joint, the elastic material, and the motor allows for a smooth and responsive force feedback system. Now, let's discuss the force feedback performance of the haptic module. Force feedback was measured with an FT sensor, showing a maximum error of 0.0794 newtons, indicating high precision. Using a stronger spring in the module increased the maximum force output, providing more robust feedback. This shows that the haptic module's performance can be adjusted by modifying the spring strength, offering flexibility based on task requirements. The haptic module is attached to the middle phalanx for a comfortable fit. Additional add-ons can be installed on the fingertip to enhance functionality. Position estimation algorithms are used, relying on the ratio between finger phalanges and the relationship between the DIP and PIP joints to ensure accurate movement tracking. The results are as follows. The position estimation errors ranged from 11.6 mm to 14.12 mm, indicating a small deviation in accuracy during the module's operation. We evaluated the movements of the haptic glove and robot hand based on Kutkowski's grasping taxonomy. The actual movements of the robot hand and glove are as shown in the video above. By connecting to a humanoid robot, we confirmed the suitability for tasks such as passing an item to a person and operating a drill at a remote location through the index finger. In conclusion, this study presents the design, fabrication, and analysis of the SNU Avatar Haptic Glove. We used a triangular series elastic actuator, SA, that shares one potentiometer for force feedback, eliminating the need for additional potentiometers. Despite being attached to the middle phalanx, 
we demonstrated that fingertip position estimation is possible through joint coupling. Additionally, we confirmed the effective movement of the remote robot hand using grasp taxonomy to assess performance. Thank you for listening.